Namaste and welcome. Today we'll be focusing on Agya, which is our center of focus and intuition. So Agya, as we know, is also called third eye and we'll be working in this practice on uh, mm, enhancing our focus. So we will go through a sequence which will allow us to find balance on a physical level and on a spiritual level as well. So come to Sukhasana, a comfortable seated position. Take your time to find your base. You can lift your shoulders up, back and down to open the chest, crown to the sky, finding length in the spine, connecting the base to the sky. So we are rooted and uplifted at the same time. And start observing your breath in and out through your nose. Take a deep inhalation, full yogic breath, expand your belly, your ribcage, your chest. And a very long exhalation. Slowly bring palms to your chest. And we'll open the practice with three om. Om Om Slowly release your hands on your lap. And we'll start the practice with a round of Kapalabhati, which will also involve Kumbhaka. So, Baya Kumbhak and Antar Kumbak. So external retention on the last exhalation. You are also welcome to draw your chin to your chest and engage Mula Bandha, Jalandara Bandha and Udhyana Bandha. And then lifting your chin, you will inhale, inhale, inhale to hold the breath in Antar Kumbak, engaging Mula Bandha and Jalandara Bandha, and then slowly exhale to release. So finding comfort, sitting up straight, relax your face, relax your shoulders, take a couple of deep breaths in and out, and then we may begin we may count 40 Kapalabhati. So 
let's begin. Three recovery breaths here. And just stay here in this state of complete stillness. Your mind is still. And let's prepare for a second round of Kapalabhati with Kumbhaka. So Kapalabhati is a great technique to work on our focus. So it's, uh, it's called uh, the, the Kriya of the Shining Skull because we are kind of polishing of skull, polishing the mind, refining our focus. So a couple of breaths to prepare and then we shall begin with 40 round Kapalabhati. Three recovery breaths.
and return to your natural breathing. Find that in this moment of stillness, your body is light, your mind is empty. Feel the expansion in your third eye. And visualize a bright flow of energy entering through your third eye and reaching your mula dara chakra. So in this way we are connecting the power of Shiva, your third eye, and Shakti, the energy at the base of your spine. Slowly return to the present moment and gently open your eyes. So, connected to Agya Chakra, we have the Bija Mantra Om. So, we're going to chant Om five times. Breathing in to begin. Om. and stay with this beautiful vibration. Extend your arms on the mat. Inhale to raise to the sky. Exhale, palms to Namaskara Mudra. Inhale and exhale. And let's follow this flow for three more times, looking up and looking down, warming up the neck, arms and shoulders. And exhale, release your hands. Let's start with big circles, moving the body, taking up all the space, giving your spine a gentle stretch.
opposite direction. Pull from back, to open the chest and curve the spine. Inhale and exhale. In, out. In and out. Last time. And exhale. And then return to the center. Breathing in and out. Make your way to tabletop position. So hands on the wrist, knees on the hips. Marjariasana, inhale and exhale to curve and lower on your knees. Again, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. and out return to the center find your center of gravity Find your stability. From here, inhale, extend your right leg out. Foot is flexed. Lift your left arm. Core is engaged. Your right thigh rotates internally to keep the hips in line. Find the focus for your gaze. So working on your balance using your third eye to find focus and concentration and slowly exhale to lower other side extend your left leg right arm finding balance breathing in and out core engaged and slowly release widen your knees big toes together find balasana three om here om Come back to the center, tuck your toes, downward facing dog, you can keep your knees bent, just to send your tailbone to the sky, pressing on your hands, spreading your fingers, focusing on the root of your index finger. Inhale and exhale. 
shoulders away from ears. And slowly walk your feet between your hands, find Uttanasana, option to keep your knees bent here as well. Drop your head, drop your arms. Slowly unroll your spine and come to standing, Tadasana. Shoulders down, crown to the sky, feet rooted. Connecting the sky to the earth. Bring your palms to your chest. Three rounds of traditional Surya Namaskar to welcome this beautiful solar energy into our body, into our mind. Shiva Shakti. Inhale to raise your arms up, slight back bend. Exhale, Uttanasana. Step your right foot back, drop your knee, lengthen the spine, Chetakasana. Left foot back, Palakasana. Lower knee, chest, chin, Ashtanga Namaskarasana. Inhale, Bhujangasana. Option for baby cobra here. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Three Om here. Om. Right foot to the front, drop your left knee, straighten your spine. Left foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up to Urvasasana. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Other side. Inhale, Urvasasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Left foot back, drop your knee, Setakasana, lengthen your spine, look front. Right foot back, Palakasana. Exhale to knee, chest, chin, Ashtanga Namaskarasana. Inhale to Bhujangasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Left foot to the front, drop your right knee, look front. Right foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up, Uttvastasana. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. One deep breath here. Second round. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Right foot back, Chetakasana. Look front. Left foot back, Palakasana. 
Exhale to Ashtanga Namaskarasana. Inhale to Bhujangasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Spanasana. Three Om here. Om. Om. Right foot to the front, drop your left knee, Sitakasana. Left foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Left side. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Left foot back. Chitakasana, look front, lengthen your spine. Right foot back, Palakasana. Exhale to Ashtanga Namaskarasana. Inhale to Bhujangasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Left foot to the front, drop your right knee, look front. Right foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Last round. Try and see if you can do this round with your eyes closed. See what happens. Inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Step your right foot back, drop your knee, Chitakasana. Lengthen the spine. Left foot back, Palakasana. Engage your core. Strong arms, strong legs. Exhale to Ashtanga Namaskarasana, knee chest, chin. Inhale to Bhujangasana. Open your chest, drop your shoulders. Exhale, downward facing dog. And here use your Bija Mantra Om to expand in this asana. So with, with each exhalation in Om, try to guide your tailbone a bit higher up, your heels to the ground, create more space in the body and in the mind as well. So three om here. Om. Press your hands. Om. Heels to the ground. Om. Exhale, exhale from the belly. Right foot to the front, drop your left knee, Chetakasana. Left foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra. Left side, inhale, Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Left foot back, drop your knee, Chetakasana. Right foot back, Palakasana. Exhale to Ashtanga Namaskarasana. Inhale to Bhujangasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Left foot to the front. Drop your knee. Right foot to the front, Uttanasana. Inhale to come all the way up. Exhale, Namaskara Mudra.
and take a moment here to give thanks to Adinat Shiv, the one who invented and shared this beautiful practice of yoga with us. Release your arms, check your alignment of feet on the hips. Inhale to raise your arms up, grab your left wrist with your right hand, exhale, open to the left, side stretch, breathing in and out. Core slightly engaged, inhale up and exhale, release both arms. One big inhalation and a long exhalation. And then inhale to raise your arms up, grab your right wrist, open to the left, look up. Inhale up and exhale to release. So we're going to do standing Kati Chakrasana. So let's get ready for Kati Chakrasana. We're going to up on the collarbone so um, not on the heart space but on the collarbone inhale in the center and exhale on the side Inhale to lengthen your spine for a moment, Ardha Uttanasana. And exhale to lower. Inhale to unroll your spine. Coming to Tadasana. From here, find your root. So, put your weight on your left foot, lift your right knee, find a point of focus which may help you keep the spine straight and stay in balance 
it is totally fine if we fall as long as we come up again. So lower your shoulders, relax your face. Keeping your right foot super active, that may help also with balance. And slowly lower. Coming to the other side, shift all the weight on the right foot. Hug your left knee towards your center. Active feet, breathing in and out. Drishti your gaze, your focus, working to find stability despite the chaos, using your concentration to find peace and stillness when there is a storm and slowly release. Hands on your hips. We may sway side to side just to release the tension in the hips, in the legs. Shake, 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 shake. And then We're going to do Vrikshasana, tree pose. So left foot rooted, draw your right foot on either on your left ankle. So if this is enough for you, that's okay. It could be on your calf here or on your inner thigh. So any variation is okay. So wherever you are, Find your drishti, find your center of focus, trying to keep the spine straight. And if you're ready, you can choose to bring your palms to your chest. Namaskara mudra or lift in Gyan mudra. Shoulders down. Breathing in and out. Beautiful trees. Being one with nature. Being one with the universe. Three breaths here. And slowly release the pose. Let's shake, 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 shake. Find a bit of comfort. Release the tension. And slowly let's go to the other side. So right foot grounded. And lift your left foot. Do the same variation you did before in order to find symmetry in the body. So left foot presses the right inner thigh. So they're pressing against each other. And there you will find your point of balance. Core is engaged. Hands on your hips. Namaskara mudra. Or option to Gyan Mudra.
and whenever you're ready, release the pose. Six, 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 six. Inhale to raise your arms up, Urdhvastasana. Exhale to Uttanasana. From here, step back, find your downward facing dog. Big, big stretch. Inhale, come into plank. Exhale, lower on the mat. Forehead on the ground, elbows in, hands pressing. Inhale to lift, big cobra. Exhale, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Slowly walk your feet between your hands. Uttanasana. Inhale to land. Inhale to Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale Uttanasana. Now from here, walk your hands forth. Inhale and lift your right leg up. Variation of Virabhadrasana. Three. So we try to keep the hips in line. So right foot can be flexed or pointed. Then slightly bend your front leg and see if you can find balance here. And slowly release, step back, downward facing dog, big, big stretch. Inhale into Palakasana, exhale to lower. Inhale open to Bhujangasana, exhale Adho Mukha Svanasana. And slowly walk your feet between your hands. Uttanasana. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. So walk your hands to the front. And from here, lift your left leg up. And slowly find your variation of Vira 3. Slowly let go, step back, downward facing dog, inhale into plank, drop your knees, cross your legs and come to seated, lie on your back. So we are going to do Setu Bandhasana. First find your alignment. So heels on the knees, pressing your shoulders, your arms. You can also Lift. You may also lift your forearms 
to strengthen this sort of push. Inhale to lift your hips, engage your thighs, engage your glutes, chest towards your chin. Exhale to lower one vertebra at a time. Inhale. And slowly exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now rest your hands. Inhale to push. Interlock your fingers. Draw your shoulders in. Lift your hips to the sky. Breathing in and out. And slowly, slowly lower. Stay in neutral spine. One moment. Then draw your knees towards your chest. To release the tension in the lower back. And then slowly release your feet. We're getting ready for Salamba Sarvangasana, shoulder stand. So if you need, use a blanket or something soft behind your shoulders and behind your head to support you in this pose. Remember, it is okay to do this pose in this version. So you can just lift your legs up and stay here. If you are comfortable with um, Sarvangasana, let's do it together. So inhale, lift your hips, support your spine with both hands. So engage the core, engage the glutes, engage the thighs, your drishti is to your big toes. Remember not to turn your head to the side, it's very dangerous for your neck. So when you hear there is no weight on your head, absolutely no weight on the head. Breathing in and out. And slowly, slowly release. Let's get ready for fish pose. We are going to draw the hands under the butt, extending your legs out, lifting the chest on your elbows. Exhale, drop your head to the crown, to the ground. Opening chest, throat. This is a great counter pose after shoulder stand. Inhale to lift and exhale to release, slowly draw your knees towards your chest, you may roll side to side,
and then tuck his arms. Inhale, and on the exhalation, drop your knees to the right, look left. Try to keep your left shoulder on the mat. Breathing in and out. Inhale back to the center. Exhale to the other side. Inhale, return. Hug your knees. Rolling, fold them back. Make your way to seated with your legs crossed in Sukhasana. Shoulders relaxed, face relaxed. And let's get ready for alternate nostril breathing. So we are going to Close the right nostril, inhale from the left, exhale from the right, and then inhale from the right, and exhale from the left. So this is one round. So this type of breathing technique will help us balance the energies in our body. So Ida and Pingala. So these are two opposing forces to energies that need to find balance in order to provide us with the highest state of well-being. So through this pranayam technique we will be able to still the mind and connect to our blissful self. So let's begin, spine straight, face relaxed, shoulders down. So five rounds, let's begin. Left to right, right to left. On your last exhalation, release your hands on your lap. Take a deep breath in through both nostrils. And a long breath out. Two more cycles. And just notice this sense of profound well-being.
complete sense of stillness and calm. So through prana, we can still the vrittis, the fluctuations in our mind. So without opening your eyes, slowly make your way to Shavasana. Extend your legs, extend your arms, palms facing up. Take up all the space you need to find comfort in Shavasana. Recharging in Shavasana. Relax your toes, relax your feet, relax your ankles, relax the calves, the knee joints, the thighs, completely relax your hips, your belly, the ribcage, the chest, soften the shoulders, the arms, the wrists, the palms, the fingers, relax necks and throats, soften the chin, relax your jaw, unclench the teeth, Relax your face muscles. Completely relax the space between your eyebrows. Agya Chakra, the place of intuition, the place of clarity. And visualize a bright light entering through Agya, reaching the crown of your head, expanding in all directions, reaching every single cell in your body. Shavasana. Slowly return to your body, return to your breath, take a deep inhalation and a long exhalation. Start moving your toes your fingers, wrists, ankles. Give your body a gentle stretch. Bend your knees, take arms overhead. And whenever you're ready, make your way to the right side and stay here for one last moment to soak up this sensation of enormous well-being. I'm calm, I'm still, I'm present to myself. Pride yourself for showing up to your sadhana, which is your physical and spiritual practice. And whenever you're ready, come.
come to Siti, to Kasana, keeping the right closed, shoulders relaxed. Slowly bring palms to Namaskara Mudra. Breathing into Om and Trishan. Om. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Namaste.